It's called a reverse crunch using a ball. And it's a great way to work your core, but also to engage your hamstrings. So it's going to look like this. I'm going to lie down on the ground. And then I'm going to grab the ball, squeezing my legs, pulling the ball in towards my butt. So I've got a nice tight grip. Heels are really pressing, pressing into the ball. Then I can go hands on my ears. And all I'm going to do is think about rolling that ball up and towards my chest and then allowing it to roll away from my chest. So again, what I want you to do now is just take a look at my hips. My hips roll up off the floor and then right back down. This is a very intense version. If you're just starting out, it might be a little bit easier to place your hands on the floor so you can press your hands into the floor and help your hips get up off the floor and then allow them to return back down to the floor. Last thing I'm going to point out here, it's really important that we keep our head flush to the floor so the back of my head's actually in contact with the floor throughout the entire exercise. You're going to find that your body wants to make this as easy as possible. And the easiest way to do that is to start bringing your chin towards your chest. And that just recruits your upper abs. We're really trying to isolate our lower abs with this exercise. That's your reverse crunch with the ball.